Hey everyone, it's Ivan, KeithAbster.com, out here for another gear review, and today, talking pants. These guys right here, which are the Neptune Pants by Tactical Distributors. Well, Tactical Distributors sells all kinds of different brands, whether it's Cry Precision, Arcteryx, stuff along those lines. They also do some pretty cool in-house stuff that kind of borders on some technical apparel. So that is kind of where these fall in. These are their Neptune Pants, and something kind of cool about tactical distributors is they'll have a number of different things whether it's like their carlos ray pants or uh, these neptune pants spray. and they will continue to make them largely in batches depending on kind of the season and then when they redo them they might do little tweaks here or there so if you've had a pair of their neptune pants in the past these unlike the other ones are kind of more of a slim fit but between materials and cut and some other stuff, they have some pretty cool things going on. As far as material goes, it is 90% nylon, 10% elastane. There is stretch to it and it dries really quick and it's just really lightweight. Some kind of cool features built into it where a lot of stuff is actually laser cut on this to include essentially ventilation holes. So right here is like belt loops up at your waistline. This is one of the back pockets, and there's a number of little vent holes. Also, in the gusseted crotch, there are those same vent holes. Allows airflow. Again, really nice, especially in hot weather. And they use this same technology even in the back pockets where essentially little holes for drainage to include the internal pockets too. So they're not going to carry water. Uh, one thing I will say, sample size of one, is when these get cut out, it doesn't necessarily go away, ant. It doesn't necessarily all pop all the way out. So one or two might be stuck and you will feel it and then you just pull it off. Whatever, sample size of one. Uh, as far as all the zippers and stuff, YKK zippers, this back pocket, I've worn these a lot. And I finally just looked at it and I'm like, oh, that's how it happened. The seam actually blew out. It's double stitched, but I eventually blew out that seam on that left back pocket. Funny story. I was actually doing some shooting at a pistol and grappling class with Bill Rapier, Amtac Shooting. And I walked up to the range. I just downloaded like live ammo, walked up, had three magazines in my back pocket, went through, hey, we're gonna do this, this, this. I'm like, all right, cool. I'm walking like, that's kind of weird. Literally one of my pistol magazines went through there and I like pulled it out of my shoe or my sock, I guess. I was like, hmm, okay. And that's why. I've definitely worn these a lot though. As far as pockets, there's eight. So you have the two back pockets, which are zippered. Not a huge fan of zippered pockets, but they work. And then you have two side pockets, also zippered like thigh. And they're sized, you can put a phone in there, AR mag, whatever you want. And then the two hand pockets on either side, actually like they're fairly deep. So you can put things in them to include like my pocket sheath when I carry my knife. And then they have this little pocket up top. Traditionally on like jeans, it's like a coin pocket. It also fit pistol magazine. Personally, I would actually like this pocket moved down there. So if you want to carry a pistol mag, one, it's not exposed. It's all the way inside your pocket. And two, the way I carry stuff, I actually use these for internal organization where I'll put like lighter chapstick or I'll put my Fisher space pin in one. So when I reach into my pocket, it's not like digging through everything. I know exactly where it is, but those pockets are there. They're just a little higher than I would like. Other things worth mentioning, inside of the waist, there's actually this really nice, comfortable mesh material. Same with the inside of the hem on your legs. And around here, you have technically six belt loops, but really five. On the back here, these two are next to each other. And then you also have a carabiner loop if you clip stuff back there. And we get into fit, I guess. So these are kind of a slim fit. So if that doesn't work for you, then these probably will not work. But one thing I do actually like with their sizing, while it does go evens, which I guess I'm probably about a 32, 
an AB33 if I want to give myself room for carrying a pistol. These are even sized, which is fine, but I do appreciate that they have different end seam as far as in the different sizes, you can either get 30 inch, 32, or 34 inch in seam. In seam, if I can talk. But now we'll talk about, yeah, how I've actually used these. These have kind of largely become my go-to hot weather pants in that whether I'm backpacking up in the mountains, especially during the summer, or even time on the range where it's gonna be sunny and it's gonna be hot, and what's nice wearing shorts sometimes, sometimes you just wanna get the sun off you. And these I can also wear through and they're just really cool also. So if I end up splashing through stuff, they'll get wet, doesn't matter, they dry out quick, they're not cotton, and yeah, just really lightweight. And I've spent a bunch of time in them in the back country, as well as time on the range and just around town. So who do I think these would be good for? Honestly, anyone looking for some pants for hot and or hot, humid weather. They're really nice in that they dry really quick, even if you start sweating into them. And as far as just breathability, especially with all the little vents to include in the crotch. And yeah, no, they've, they've done good for me. Something I do like also about tactical distributors is you get cool camo patterns. These are obviously pretty vanilla, but they have all kinds of different ones. And again, they make them like annually, seasonally, I guess. And so I think they probably still have these in frog skin, probably one of my favorite camo patterns. But yeah, all together pretty cool. You can get them over at Tactical Distributors. Price-wise, I wanna say around 65 bucks. And if you're like, ah, oh, that is way too much, well, then get them on sale, which stuff over there is always going on sale, which is awesome. And if I can, look down below. I should have a discount code for you. But overall, pretty sweet, like warm, hot weather pants for, honestly, most activities. But There'll be links down below if you want to check them out. And last but not least, if you appreciate my content and want to support it, greatly appreciate it. One of the ways going over to Teespring or Ballistic Inc, picking up t-shirts, that stuff helps me out or supporting me directly through Patreon. Little as a dollar a month, get early access to videos, some exclusive stuff. And if you have questions for me, happy to answer them over there or we have an active Discord. But as always, thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com. Look forward to seeing you next time. Go out,